Uh, previously, I mean, obviously, we're one of the major brands globally, uh, biggest uh, European brass manufacturer, um, doing a lot of major activity around development. As you can see around the stand here today, one of the key factors for us is design. So over the last five years, we've won key design awards, four best of the best with the Red Dot organization. So that's been very good for us. In the UK, obviously, uh, 2008 onwards has been a, it was the big challenge that faced the whole world, never mind just the industry. Starting to see the recovery of that, good growth. Um, and now it's putting initiatives into place to ride the recovery from um, the financial changes that we've all faced to get some big impact and expand and offer the public what they want still. I mean, through the uh, hard period, we still managed to keep bringing out new products each year. So we've kept our development going. We've never stalled it. We need. We know that customers, consumers, which then aids the installers and the business to keep selling products with innovation, new designs and major activities uh, to support all aspects from consumer through to the distributor. I think uh, we, we've certainly seen some recovery. Um, I mean, there's still challenges globally. I've recently been out at uh, Marketing Meeting where we see the effects across Europe. Um, we're all recovering at different rates, but certainly from a UK perspective, we've got a positive outlook. Yeah. Looking at our distribution network, we've recently launched, as an example, uh, an installer club. Now, we've launched that month one. We've had a significant number of sign-ups, um, which is showing positive sign. We did some also, so as part of the development work for that, we're doing some work with the installers. Uh, question and answer sessions, what do you want, what are you seeing in the marketplace? And we didn't see a total negativity. They seemed, yeah, okay, there's some challenges. It's not going to be totally easy, but they were positive about the future. And one of the things that they were, their feedback was is as long as we've got products and things coming through that can help us to move forward, they were positive about the future forward. And that's the big impact for me because they're the guys on the ground. They're the ones who are actually going out, selling our products and uh, putting them into the bathrooms and kitchens for people. Uh, London, uh, KBB London for us is the preview for Grow Spa, uh, which is our basically premium ranges offering some key design initiatives. We've got a Lure Brilliant on stand launching July this year, so we've brought over some key samples. I want to make sure the uh, people like yourself, Tim, can uh, see what's coming up anew. We also have, as part of the spa message and well-being, we've got our Grow Blue on tap. So filtered teas, filtered uh, water, that refreshment and uh, key activities. A company in Grower Blue, we have Grower Red, uh, filtered, boiling hot water, ready to go, replacement of your, uh, your kettle um, to give that clean kitchen that we all like these days. We're seeing more of a minimalist look market coming through, so we've got something to offer that, an all-in-one solution. We've got some key product launches you'll have seen from previous events like at ISH where we launched 350 new products into the market, some key key changes in technology with digital coming on later in the year, Grow a Red, Grow a Blue. We're in a position where although we've had challenges to make sure our Grow a Red is approved and the, one of the key products in the market, we've been in a position to drive that through and that makes me as somebody who's new into a role positive for the rest of the year and Grow a Spa, key message, something for the showrooms to work with, something for the uh, installers to work with, all of the brochures and literature show some very clean concepts, designs, some inspiration, uh, and like things, I mean, uh, other things we've done are the water enjoyment book. Um, all of the major projects we've worked on around the world, some insight into what happened with them, the designs and everything else, to try and give some inspiration. We all want our spa at home.